Hey there, Jada is grateful she made it through this severe illness, and now the 22-year-old, along with her parents, are planning to spread positivity during this pandemic. It really isn't fun, but you get through it, and then it's okay. And Jada Pfeiffer, a junior at University of North Carolina, Chapel Hill, tells 12 News the worst of the virus for her is over. I hadn't been sleeping that much in the Bahamas, and I thought I was just tired, but I was really, like, achy. She says she started feeling sick after getting home from the Bahamas for spring break before cases really became prevalent in the United States and with younger people. I started getting a little tiny cough, then I started to get a little more worried. I woke up with a fever and decided that it was probably time to go. Jada went to a campus clinic and ultimately tested positive. At one point it was bad. I tried to walk like 100 yards and I had to stop and I was heaving and just like couldn't breathe. Meanwhile, her parents, Jack and Susan, who live in Scottsdale, say they felt their hands were tied when it came to wondering. And ironically, we were supposed to visit her at UNC last, week. last weekend and we were all excited to go see her. And it's just been a, obviously constant worry. But they stayed in touch daily and did come up with a way to celebrate her recovery. We wanted it to be where people can wear the shirt and feel good about it. And we asked her first uh, before we even did this. And her response was, oh my gosh, I totally wear that shirt. Jada with advice for all of us who worry about getting the virus. You can make it through it and get to the other side. A percentage of the profits from the recovered shirt sales will go to the World Health Organization COVID-19 Solidarity Response Fund. You can find a link in the 12 News app. We're in Scottsdale. Rachel Cole, 12 News.